Hi guys, I'm Marie from Ramblings of a Daydreamer. Welcome to In My Mailbox week 17, I think. I didn't do an IMM last week because I was in Niagara Falls for the weekend. So I have two weeks worth of stuff to show you. Not a whole lot of stuff, but um, yeah, I'll get right to it. Oh, first of all, the ebooks that I got. I, um, I bought Jenny Pox by J.L. Bryan a few weeks ago and kept forgetting to mention it. And, um, by bought, <laughs> I mean it was free on Amazon. I'm not sure if it still is, but I've heard so many amazing things about Jenny Pox. And when I heard that it was free, I rushed over and got it, even though I won't be able to read it for a while. Because I'm so far behind in my reviews. But anyway, I got that. And I was also sent Within by Claire Marshall. She is a fellow Canadian author, and she emailed me about reviewing my book and being part of my blog tour, so I'm going to review her book and be part of her blog tour, which is pretty cool. So that's in January. Um, yeah, so I'm excited to read that. Last week all I got was bookmarks, which I'm having issues with here. Uh, in October, Lisa from A Life Bound by Books had this big month-long thing and she had a whole bunch of Halloween-related giveaways. And the one that I won was um, doodle bookmarks from authors. So, I got that. A whole bunch of different authors. Um, Anna Carey, Gemma Halliday, Kat Clark. They're so cute. I love them. Super, super cute. So I won those. And I also got... Wander Dust Bookmarks from Michelle Warren. So pretty. This cover, I don't know how well you can see it, is one of my favorite covers of 2011. I just think it's gorgeous. And they're signed. I haven't read Wander Dust yet, but I'm going to. I haven't even bought it yet because I'm so far behind in my reading that I knew it would just like sit on my computer. But when I do read it and review it, I will probably give away some of these. And I will also be including these in the 400 follower slash birthday celebration giveaway that I have going on right now at the blog. Um, if you've entered, I had mentioned that I was waiting for a bit more swag, and this was it. So now I have these. I have uh, Flame of Surrender bookmarks from Rhiannon Pale, Being Human bookmarks from Patricia Lynn, and a signed Fairy Ring bookmark from Kiki Hamilton, and a few other things. So if you haven't entered the giveaway, be sure to do that. I'm giving away a book as well as a couple of swag packages. So thank you very much, Michelle for sending me these. Michelle is so nice. If you aren't part of her Facebook page, you should go do that immediately because she is so, so nice. She answers like every comment on her Facebook page, which is, I find, fairly rare with some authors. And she does shout outs to book blogs. She's done a number of shout outs to my book page for Blue Sky Days. She has giveaways all the time. Her blog tour is going on right now. So be sure to check that out because she's giving away these really cool necklaces with a Tolkien quote that I want desperately. <laughs> and I think she's giving away bookmarks and a paper pack of the book maybe. But anyway, be sure to check that out. And say hi because she's so, so nice. And she also included this little note, which I love. I don't think enough people include notes. I can't tell you how much stuff I've gotten and it's just like an envelope with bookmarks. And it's like, okay, <laughs> take two seconds and write a note. So thank you, Michelle. I appreciate that a lot. The only book I got this week is Lucky Stiff by Deborah Kuntz. This is the second book in the what is it? Lucky O'Toole Vegas Adventure Series. Um, Leanne, one of the publicists, sent me 
want to get lucky like a month or two ago and then sent me this one so I haven't read the first one yet I've got to get going now that I have this I really do have to get going I'm so far behind so yeah thank you very much Leanne for sending me that I'm anxious to read this it says Sin City with a dash of CSI and Janet Ivanovich so I love Janet Ivanovich and that was actually what Leanne contacted me about she I had that on my blog and she said if you like Janet Ivanovich you'll like these so from the library, I got Eve by Anna Carey. Been waiting for this one for quite a while, and I'm really excited about that. I think my library just got this one. Yeah, November 17th. They just got it, and I think I was the first one maybe to get it. I've been on hold for quite a while. And actually, in the doodle bookmarks I got, one of them is from Anna Carey. is Eve. So while I'm reading Eve, I will use my Eve bookmark. <laughs> and yes, I'm a geek. But, yeah. Anyway. I also got Supernaturally by Kirsten White. I read Paranormalcy in September, I think. And this is another one that my library just got. Yeah, the same date as Eve. So I'm looking forward to that one. I really, really enjoyed Paranormalcy. And can't wait to find out what happens. I didn't buy any books this week. Um, I got quite a bit of mail, but it wasn't books. Uh, my mom hasn't been feeling very well, so she hasn't been able to get out to start her Christmas shopping. So she, on Black Friday and Cyber Monday, she told me that I could order some stuff for myself from Amazon. So I did, because my birthday is coming up, and then Christmas is like a week and a bit later. So... One of the things I got that arrived this week was Seasons 1 and 2 of Vampire Diaries, which I'm super excited about. I watched Season 1, and I missed, somehow I missed most of Season 2. I don't know why, whether they switched the date, and it, like, I had something else. I don't know. Anyway, so I've been watching Season 3, so I can finally get caught up. So excited about that. I get Season 1 for my birthday, and Season 2 for Christmas. And I got a few other DVDs. No books, because I'm doing a Secret Santa thing. And I'm not sure what is being sent to me. So I didn't want to risk buying a book that somebody had sent to me already. So yeah, that's it. The only reading-related thing that I got was from my mom. It's a Hello Royal Wedding magazine which I had the first time I did the video and I forgot stuff so I had to do it a second time and it's up there buried under clothes <laughs> because I put it back where she can't see it so yeah Royal Wedding Magazine with um, Kate and William and then like Royal Weddings throughout history so that's pretty neat and I also got her the Royal Wedding DVD we got up at like 4.45 to watch the Royal Wedding in April um, we've always had this thing about the royal family. On my mom's side, everybody likes the royal family. So I knew she'd be pleased with those. So I got that, and that's all I got. That's the only reading-related thing that I bought this week. Um, this week on the blog, I have two blog tours. I'm doing, um, Scorpio Rising by Monique Domovich. I have the review for this on Tuesday and then a guest post from Monique on Wednesday. And then on Thursday I have an interview with Kelly York who wrote Hushed. And I have to finish Hushed today. It's an ebook. Um, and I'll probably post the review Monday. So I've got most of this week booked. And I also finished reading The Name of the Star by Maureen Johnson. So I'll probably have that review posted this week, too. And I think that's it. Um, yeah, be sure to leave a comment below and tell me what you got in your mailbox. Be sure to enter my giveaway if you haven't already. And I will see you guys next week. Have a fantastic week. Bye, guys.